This is your one and only FireSpark81 with your daily dose of video goodness, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Reform Friday, where we play some random video game, and today's game is called Foundation. It's an organic city building game. And you guessed it, it's early access, because what game isn't these days? Anyway, uh, let's get to it. We're going to go new game, we're going to go uh, hills, sure, and uh, start game. Alright, so we got a help screen, getting started. Um, I don't want to read all that. Does it not have a tutorial? It's like we have actions, quests, logs, warnings, system. Okay, nothing there. We can move with the W, A, S, and D keys. That's good. I saw little people in some screenshots, but I apparently don't have any little people. I wonder if we have to build something first. Paint development zones. Build public buildings. Can't click any of that. Villager list. We have no villagers. Oh, build this land. Okay, I see. We have to select our land first. This one over here. Actually, this one has it too. We have a stone here. We have some berries here. This one looks kind of flat. Let's just take this one. Okay, so we clicked it. You have a new quest. Build a villager center. Okay. So let's go to build public buildings, villager center, and why does it look so tiny? Is it is it really that tiny? No, there's no way. That's just got to be like okay, yeah, yeah. That's just some boxes. Okay, I see. So yeah, start construction. Do the thing. Oh, okay. Well, that does, and then it just pops out some people. They were in that box the whole time. I don't know if there were any air holes or not, but there definitely wasn't a bathroom. Anyway, now we need to go over here and build. We got general. We can build a builder's workshop. Monument. All right, so I guess we just need to build the builder's workshop. So where are we going to stick that? Can we, can we, ro oh, we can rotate the whole camera with uh, E and Q. Let's just slap it down there. It doesn't need to be rotated. It's fine. There, start building. Looks great. Perfect. Builder's workshop. They should be doing the thing now. Oh, look at all the new stuff we got now. Okay, lumber camp. We're definitely going to need that. We've seen this before in plenty of other city building games where they only like harvest in the area that's the circle. So let's just put that right there. That looks like a great place for it. Okay, are they going to do the thing? Do I control them? Oh, they're unemployed. All right, you are a builder. And you are a builder. You are a woodcutter. We're only going to have one woodcutter because I need these other people to do other things. So we'll have two builders. We need a gather hut. Let's get that going. Let's put that by the berries. I wish... Oh, wait. I didn't even see down at the bottom. It says things. Okay, so control and horizontal mouse movement to rotate. I can't believe I didn't even see those. I was looking at the thing and not looking at the text. I often get blind to text. Does anybody else have that problem? Like, there's always just... You're so inundated with stuff all the time on your screen. Ads and all kinds of other stuff that... I just get blind to stuff that's on the screen all the time. All right, so that looks good right there. We're just going to click start construction and they will do that. So we're going to need a gatherer. Hello, you. You are now a forager. Enjoy your new foraging lifestyle. Okay, so now let's go over here. Let's go to... We should probably... Don't these people need like some homes? They probably need a well. We can build a granary, a gathering hut, stone cutters, sawmill, monuments, decoration. So they don't need a house, apparently. Apparently they just do whatever they want to do, and that's fine. And then we can build some walls. We haven't unlocked those yet. It states, oh, what is, what is that? That's all kinds of stuff. And then we have military manager. Is there fighting? Apparently there is fighting. Territories, our budget, trade. I guess we should just build this stuff here. Probably important. Does this do anything here? Okay, so we can see who's assigned to it. That's pretty cool. I guess we'll just go through and build each of these things. So the well, 
Um, sure. Does it gotta go to all of the buildings? Probably just needs to go to the houses. But, uh, yeah, sure. Maybe it's one of those ones where they'll just start throwing up their own houses after a given point of time. And then we need... Do we want the granary just yet? Oh, yes. That's to store stuff. So we're, we're gathering stuff here. So let's store stuff mm, right next to it like that. Let's rotate it just a little bit. Yep, that looks great. Okay, perfect. So we are spending resources that we have up here, so we've got to be careful we don't spend too much, but I do want to try to get a majority of these. Well, we built the, the logger, so let's build the reforcer, or the forester, so that we can reforce. And we're just going to place that right there, start construction on that. Okay, so now let's go and build, let's get the sawmill too. Oh, actually, no, let's hold off on the sawmill. Let's build the stone cutter. I assume these are the stones that the stone cutter harvest. I could be wrong, but I'm just assuming that that's the case. So we're just going to put that right next to those like that. And then we need to, we have a few people here that need some jobs. So you, you're unemployed. You're going to be Forster. Perfect. And you, you, you're unemployed. Wow, I just realized <laughs> the icons there. She looks rough. She's 21 years old. Look at her. Look at that picture there. She looks really rough. Uh, let's see here. You are going to be, I guess, the miner. Door. Oh, nope, can you not? Can't find a place to work. Well, that's because it hasn't been built yet. It, it'll get there. So who doesn't have a job? You're a woodcutter. You're a forester. You're a builder. You're unemployed. And they, they all look terrible. Like, look at that one. Look at that one's face. <laughs> wow. Okay, so let's go... Let's click this, and what else do we need here? Do we need a carpenter? I think the carpenter is probably the one that works the sawmill, and we don't have a sawmill yet, but I'm going to make you a builder because we need more. Oh, can you, you can't work the building. Can you be a woodcutter? You cannot be a woodcutter. Well, what, do you, what can you do? Can you do anything? We have two assigned, two or three assigned to the builder's workshop. I should be able to assign her to the builder's workshop. At that last, there we go. Perfect. That did the thing. That did all we needed it to do, so that's fine. Okay, so now, can we speed up things? Increase speed. Make stuff happen. Do it super quickly. All right, we're at times three. I guess we're just hanging out. Okay, so we ran into the problem that the dude can't chop trees because there's no zoning. So we have to just kind of... Paint this around the trees here. So they... I like the noise that it makes. Like you're cutting it out. There we go. So now they know to do that. And then for reforestation, just paint that over top of it. Yep. Yep. Reforced right over there. Where we're doing the thing. Okay, perfect. So, and then I guess we have to paint some extraction there too, maybe? Hopefully that'll work. Okay, so now maybe they'll they'll do what they need to do. I think things are happening now. What are our actions over here? Produce berries. We are producing berries. Oh, we got a bunch of stuff here. Okay, so everything's going now. She's over here chopping away at the stone. These people are harvesting. Our reforcer area is not being built yet because it needs planks. Oh, so we're going to have to build. We're going to have to build the, what, what is it? The sawmill. But I wonder why it has a red circle when it doesn't chop the, maybe it does chop trees. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Well, let's just build all the woodworking stuff close together. Put that right there. 
That looks like a great spot. Okay, now we just need to wait for that to be built, and then we can assign somebody to it, and then have the person here also reforced. Okay, so one of the things we have to do is we have to build a market. We have a market here. Oh, do we, is it like an assign an area type deal? Where are we going to put this? Let's put this. This looks like a great place for the market. Oh, oh, okay. Food stall. Yeah, food stall. Wait, did that place down? Hold up. Can I select that? Can we cancel that? Yeah, delete that. All right, let's try this again. So we'll go over here. We go to this. We go to this. There, no, there's just one. Why is there just one? I don't understand. Monument location. Okay, and then we pick food stall. But then I can just place it anywhere. I'm confused. Can I just place it anywhere I want to place it? I guess. Uh, we should probably have it facing the right way. Which that looks like the right way. Alright, let's try to place it far from that and see what it does. We just place it right over here. Right like that. Okay. Looks like we got some decorative options too. Or we can place decorative things. I'm confused by what's happening right now. But I'm tired. So that could be that could be a thing. Alright, start construction. I don't understand why there was like two parts. I thought we were gonna like mark out an area, but then we just place a single thing. That was kind of weird. All right, so we assign the berries to the market. And unfortunately, it's facing the wrong way. Oh, no, maybe not. Maybe it's not. Maybe that wasn't the lady working it. Maybe, maybe she's just coming over to hang out. I think that's got like a thing of fish. That's pretty cool. All right, so now that we've done all that, it looks like we need to get our villager happiness to, to 100. It's at 88 right now. Not sure what else we need to do, but we definitely need to get more people to show up, that's for sure. Alright, fill the needs of your newcomers. We did that, we did that, we did that. So now we're just working on this quest here. Oh, well, it's just going up. Maybe I don't really have to do anything? Okay, it just did the thing. I didn't really have to do anything but just hang out. Increase your population size. Alright, hold on. By maximizing your immigration probability. Okay. So now I guess people just randomly show up. Have we gotten any more buildings? Let's check our building situation here. Nope, still the same things. Alright, two new villagers ar arrived again. We did unlock the Lord's Manor. And then this pop-up just popped up. So what's this say? <laughs> So, Lord's Manor House and Rustic Church. Oh, we, we got a house. Also, if we don't actually get to build the housing, we just say this is a residential zone and then they build there. Okay, so we have a lot of, we got a nice chunk here. I wonder what the, why is that red? They not like it because it's a work zone? Really? Well, that's... How picky are you? Come on. It's just a bit of a work zone. All right. Well, we'll just paint over these trees here. It's fine. So that can be all residential. Right up into here. We're going to just push it right against that gathering area right there. And some of these people can have less than favorable options. Yeah, just like that. And then push that like right up to there. Like that. That should get them started, I hope. Now, they should just do the thing. And let's build the Lord's Manor, too. Now, this, I guess, can just be anywhere. And what better spot than right here? Oh, it looks like... Okay, I think I see what's going on here. So, it looks like the Lord's Manor is multiple pieces. So, we can build the core of it, which we will build... Oh, wow, that's bigger than I thought it was going to be. Let's put it right here. Right like that. Okay, so we build that there, and then we can build on other stuff. We can do a door. Let's snap that to... Oh, I want it to be in the center. Can it not be in the center? 
Yeah, there we go. We'll snap that to the center. And then, of course, we need a tower. That's not much of a tower. Wooden tower? Wooden tower is not much of a tower either. But that's fine. We're, we'll, we'll snap that on there like that. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Now we can make it a little bit bigger. Perfect. That looks great. Okay, start construction. Okay, I just completed our Lord's Manor, and now we need to assign it a function. So we're going to assign... The center part is the Great Hall. Okay, that looks good. Apparently, we need to expand our treasury capacity to 330. Okay. Let's see what this says. Oh, nobody's nobody is joining because they won't build houses. Did they find they finally built some houses? It's about time. Okay, so these other people, maybe they don't have enough room. I mean, they should have. Let's do a little, let's do a little paint. That's big enough there. Yeah. That's big enough for a house there. Maybe the trees are in the way and they won't cut them down on their own. So let's just brush a little extraction over there. And maybe they'll just chop down those trees. Because that's, that's plenty of room. Even like right here, here. You can build right up next to the Lord Manor. Except right here. You can't build right there because if we toss an extension on... I need room. But rest of this, yeah, just build right next to your work. I don't care. Oh, look at that. See how see how that works? That's great. You have plenty of room. Pick a spot. Go ahead in the reforestation. Man, that is some thick reforestation. They don't mess around. Them foresters. Okay, so oh, we got we got a new person joined. That's nice. All right, so not a lot has happened. Uh, I do want to build another building just to kind of see how it all plays out. So we're going to grab the rustic church and I guess put it back here. We have a bunch of residential here. So let's put the church back here. Let's see what happens. Oh, it looks like the church is multi-part as well, which is kind of cool. So, we're gonna just put that right like that on the hillside. It needs a door. Slab a door on it. Ooh, wait. I kind of like the other door better. Can we get rid of that one? Put that door on it. Eh, actually, no. I did like this one better. Put that there. And then, does he get a tower? Uh, wooden cross. Hold on. Let's move this up so we can see. That's just purely decorative. Oh, it says it's all decorative. Oh, it gives, um, some splendor. It gives more splendor. So, let's do... Let's do a tower, because we like splendor. Put that there. Crank it up. Oh, yeah, look at that big old tower. The splendor... Okay, the splendor goes up with the bigger the tower. Let's go for 4.30 splendor on that bad boy, and then... Grab a cross. Do we just put that out front wherever? Looks like we do. Let's uh, let's rotate it. Bam. Cross. And then I guess that's it. Start construction. Okay, so it just clears the trees out of the way. That's cool. Well, the, if the way our forester goes, trees aren't, aren't going to be a problem at all, ever. I mean, look at it. Look at how densely it's packed in there. So we just need to wait for them to build that now and see what happens there. Hopefully that unlocks something uh, new. I don't know. All right, so it looks like our rustic church is needs one tools to be completed, and I'm not sure where or how we get tools. But what I do know is that we are well past our wrap-up time for this episode. So if you want to check this game out, I will put a link for it down in the description. Per the usual, if it goes to the Humble Store, it helps support the channel. If it doesn't, then it doesn't. All right, that is going to wrap it up for this episode. If you like what you saw, consider hitting that sub button. I want to give a big thank you to my patrons for making this episode possible. Y'all are absolutely amazing people. If you'd like to join my Elite Crew Patreon supporters, please check out the link in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a comment down below. Let me know what you thought. If you're shy, you don't like to comment, just hit that thumbs up button and show your support. Until next time, thanks for watching.